guys, welcome to Walkspace Studios. In this episode of Drop In, we're going to explore Tras and Cafe, where we're going to get wholesome of healthy meals it seems. So let's go find out. And the chef, Mr. Danish. Uh, so let's just ask him few questions about this place. Can you tell me more about the food we get here? What's special about it? So whenever we I make food or introduce anything, we keep in mind three things: that it has to be healthy. So we don't compromise on it at all. We don't deep fry things. We don't use refined oil, maida, sugar. Anything like that. Our coffee, even pizza, is super healthy. You can just have it for your day meal and be guilt free. Then we check it. Is it unique? Does it have something which is, you know, not available somewhere else and all that? It's not that we're trying to be different, but we like to have things which are different. And then the third is vegan. I've been vegan for five years. This is a Hyderabad's first vegan cafe, so we don't use any dairy, animal derived products. So whatever the food is. Unique, vegan, healthy. That's how we. Ah, uh, so I I I kind of love this. I have the love hate relationship with this question because um, you know um, people ask for best dishes because a lot of restaurants just do one dishes right, 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 and then everything is around it. I won't say names, but there's a restaurant who just serves biryani and everything is around it. But the biryani everybody goes to. Whatever we try to do is our every dish in the serve as it is unique vegan. It has a story behind it. So I don't know what to say. What's our best dish? I turn the question around and ask like, what do you like to eat? What is your taste like? And then we provide because we have everything, from soups, salads, bread based, pita bread based, rice, noodles, pizza, you name it, and we do it differently. more about the story and how what's the story behind starting this cafe and all that stuff well when i i i'm not from hyderabad and came from rajasthan uh, actually not exactly also from rajasthan i've worked in a few other places hyderabad was my where i they have just come recently i've just turned vegan i was always into healthy eating now there was another thing which was vegan and four years ago there was no place like that which was healthy forget about vegan even i don't know if serving health food so i had it in mind that You know, so much can be done in the health food. Also, the second thing is forget about vegan. Vegetarian can be made so exciting, and we are served the same. You know, curry chicken, curry, sorry, curry paneer, and all this same everywhere. Serve the same fare, and when you go to market, you see so many different vegetables, and you think like, why can't you just create a like a freaking diverse menu? So I thought we can do it. Forget about vegan, even vegetarian food. Has been been meted out so much injustice. So I thought we'll do something, and then I just started off. I didn't have any capital or something. I started on a bundi. So I used to operate it outside the German center. So the uh, the initial, uh, let's say, the embryonic stage of this place is actually a food cart. When I mean food cart, I mean that. So you have we have pictures where I'm operating a food cart. There was a big pow budget there where I was making whole wheat sandwiches, vegan sandwiches. That's how this place started. Gradually we grew. This location is three months old. Oh, is this three months? This old? location is three months old. We were operating on the same place. We developed a little. We got it a little roof made and things like that. But then uh, I think uh, we wanted to invite more people, and more people were coming, and four tables were not enough. So we just moved it. 